Welcome to DIY Spooky Decor. This week, we are cutting these $1 plastic animals that I got from Target Dollar Spot and turning them into cute little trophy decors. But we're going to go with the circus theme. So I got these three wooden plaques, I believe, from Walmart for $0.97, cents, and I am going to paint everything black. Paint the animals black, paint the things black. I forgot what they're called. The wooden plaques. Paint the wooden plaques black. And then on the back, I just used these little pieces of hard hardware. Uh, super glued them on. That's how I'm going to hang them up. Because I'm going to be ripping that plastic off. Now after I painted them black, I want to do a black and white stripe. I'm going for, you know, kind of a freak show circus theme here. And I used paint pens and a ruler and it worked so well. I'm so bad at creating straight lines and this helps so much. Um, I did do three layers on each plaque. That did not give it a completely solid coat. I still wanted some of those lines in there and the black showing through a little bit to give it that kind of dingier feeling, you know? I also used a black paint pen to clean up the edge to create a nice looking frame. I want it to dry brush my animals. I used a copper color. You can, of course, use any color that you would like. And to glue them on, I used part super glue and part hot glue for a short-term instant and long-term hold. So far, it's worked great. I haven't had any problems. Now, using red paint, I am writing Join the Circus on the bottom of all of my plaques. Um, I am so sorry for the film quality. I know it is terrible. I'm having issues with my camera again, but I, I'll figure it out eventually, so it's, it's okay. It's going to be okay. <laughs> and then, of course, some blood splatter to finish it off. Um, it's kind of got that Art the Clown vibe going on a little bit, and I'm digging it. I did spray them with a semi-gloss clear coat. And then to add a little more pizzazz, I used some feathers that I had. Um, I plucked them off of a Mardi Gras mask, just a cheap one, not a real one. And um, some boa feathers are in there as well. And I just kind of did one, each one a little bit differently to give them some extra personality. So, like, does anyone else see a face on the paper bag that I'm painting on? Like, when I lift up the project, you can kind of see, like, an abstract face in paint. Does anyone else see that? Anyway, <laughs> here they are. Join the circus. Let me know what you think in the comments down below. Don't forget to subscribe. I'm really happy with how this turned out. I absolutely love the circus vibe. And uh, until next time, stay spooky.